This suit was actually filed back in January, but was put on hold during the court proceedings against David Stevenson. He worked here for about a year and has now been convicted and sentenced for sexual abuse. And one of those victims believes that he is not the only one responsible. The attorney for the girl who is now 18 says Stevenson told her he left his former job at Abraxas Youth and Family Services after allegations there and was still able to get hired here. So she feels the county should have known about that. She also says several supervisors knew Stevenson was a risk, but never reported it. I think that there's a very strong argument that none of this had to, to happen. And at no time did we have any information or knowledge about any misconduct, sexual or otherwise, um, by Mr. Stevenson at any of his former employer, at any, anywhere. The county has filed a motion to dismiss the matter based on technical legal issues with the suit, not on the, what the suit claims. He also says that the girl is doing this lawsuit in hopes of getting money to pay for the years of counseling that she will need because of what happened here. In Lancaster County, Caitlin Smith, WGAL News 8.